Hi, this is Dan from Generation Productions, and today we've got another unboxing of uh, a big package here I've got. Um, and this is for some more of those uh, dinosaur meteor uh, crystals from Dino Arts. So we're going to crack some more of these up and see what we find. So let's get into it, shall we? Okay, people, and that song was uh, Power Rangers Dino Charge theme by um, by Neil Stas ne I don't know how to pronounce his name properly. Sorry, people. Um, N I A double L Stenton. This guy, basically. He did a good job with the theme, so. Thank you, man, and get people go subscribe to that dude's channel. So let's get into this uh, unboxing of these manual rocks and see uh, what we got. Okay. So let's see what we got. Ugh. Ugh. Now there is about. Tend to collect, and the one I'm trying to get is the one that's show, we've shown on every one of the packets, which is this one here, the uh, Crystal Tyrannosaur Tooth. That's what I'm trying to get, but we'll see how we go. I mean, I may not get it, but still. Okay, first one on the list is Parasaurite. So, let's see what we've got here. Oh, there we go. A very nice geode. Ah, yeah. Very beautiful. Ah, it's like one of those metallic geodes. I've heard of these. They're very nice. Now, as you can see, there's like a dinosaur skin on the back with the uh, crystalline in, inside. So, um, again, uh, for people who are doing fossil stuff, uh, please let me know if that's actually true, that... Uh, Fossil, like fossilized dinosaur bones can actually crystallize. I don't know. Uh, but for the sake of this uh, collection, that's what that's what's supposed to be. Like crystallized dinosaur bone, basically. So that's one pack open. And that was the uh, Paris, Paris Oh, Let's put that back here, I think. Uh, let's see, got another one. So let's see what we've got in here. Oh, hello. Stegosaurite. Now, if I rem I reckon this will be um, a quartz crystal, I reckon. Yes, there we go. A lump of quartz crystal. Very beautiful. Uh, I don't know what kind of quartz it is. I think it might be a rose quartz. But uh, very nice. Let's see what the next one is. So that's two done. So we've got two done. Now we've got another lot to go. Velociraptorite. 
So, no, I can't remember what this was, but I think this one looks pretty good. Okay, what we've got for this? This looks pretty good. Ah, another quartz. But uh, quartz, I believe, tooth or claw. Quartz, uh, quartz uh, claw. Uh, I can't remember what the name of this quartz is. It's like a rainbow quartz, I think. I don't know what the actual name of it is. I'm going to have to look that up. But yeah, that looks nice. Very, very beautiful quartz. A quartz crystal, so that's beautiful. Oops. So, let's see what else we've got. Whew. Ah, a Petrodon. So that's like a pterodactyl, basically. I think this is another geode, if I remember correctly. Yes, another beautiful geode. That's amazing. Also, I don't know what the name of the geode is. I think it's like a like a rainbowy kind of geode. So I'm not sure if it's like like it was like a white standard geode, and then when it was painted or what. But uh, yeah, that looks nice. It's a very nice geode. <sighs> I think a lot of these crystals are going to be uh, geode and quartz, if I remember correctly from last time. But uh, we'll see how we go. This one is... Ah, it's Spinosaur. Now, if I remember correctly... The Spinosaur was another uh, geode. Oh, there we go. Oh, that's very special. There's a very uniqueness to this geode. Uh, I don't know what, I don't know exactly what this one was called, but it's like a hollow geode. I don't know what the actual name of it is, but it's a very nice looking geode. Spinosaurite geode. So, uh, uh, next one. I also, I remember last time that Spinosaurite geode was the hardest one to find, so that was pretty good to see it in this in this version. Um, okay, so what's the next one? Oh, Majungasaurus. Now, Majungasaurus is it has to be similar to that of a, like like that of a T Rex, but it's not a T Rex, but it has a similar like stance to a Tyrannosaurus Rex. And I think even some people sort of said that it was actually sort of like a relation to T Rex somewhere along the, uh, the their, their their line. And there we go. Oh, there we go. This is a bit of uh, melted metal. A bit of melted metal. That's not so bad. I think this kind of uh, scrap metal would be uh, from, you know, like someone was like doing welding or something like that and they melted a bit of metal down. That's sort of what you'd get, like a clump of metal. So that's not too bad from the jungle saw. one. Ah, here we go. This is the, uh, ah, oh, Tyrannosaurite. Now, please let it be the tooth. 
I really want it to be the tooth. Because I'm looking for the one that looks like this on the card. Uh, it looks like, looks like a tooth or a claw of, of the Tyrannosaurus. That's what I'm looking for. Um, I've been trying to look for this thing for a while now. Out of this, out of this series. And I have not found it yet. So... Oh, that's close. Very close. Uh, again, this is another quartz. Very beautiful looking quartz. Uh, I'm not sure if you guys can see it. It's like purple at this end. Sort of like a pinkish red in the middle. And a little bit of orange at the top. I think that's pr probably more close to what I was actually looking for. For a tooth version. So, yeah, that, that I think that's probably the closest I'm going to get. But we'll see where we go to. I'm hoping... That's not the only one that's like that, but I'll try one to we'll see if we can find another one. But yes, that, that's the closest I've got to finding like a, uh, like this one I've been trying to look for, which is this sort of Tyrannosaur tooth looking one. So that's, that's the closest I've got so far, which is pretty good. Considering I've been opening these things for a while now. So this is my third pack of these uh, fossil cards. So it's been quite a journey with the, trying to search for that one Tyrannosaur tooth crystal. But anyway, next one, another Velociraptorite. So there we go, that's the Velociraptorite the card. Let's see what we've got here. Ooh, there we go. Again, another quartz crystal. Again, I can't remember if it's like a rainbow quartz, they call these ones, or uh, um, whether someone's actually painted it. I don't know, but it looks very, very beautiful. There we go. A nice, very, very beautiful looking quartz. And I don't, like I said, I know there is a type of rainbowy quartz that uh, looks like that too. So I don't know whether it's that kind of quartz or if it's actually um, been painted. Some of these rocks, I don't know whether they've actually been painted or whether that's the actual natural colour. I have no idea. Some are a little bit more obvious than the others, like the uh, metal ones. That they, they have definitely been painted. But uh, some of these crystals I'm not so sure about. Uh, next one is a Stegosaurite, again. Let's see what we've got here. Oh, there we go. It's even got a little bit of dirt on it too, interestingly enough. Um, yeah. Definitely doesn't look like a bone or any kind thing. It just looks, it just looks like an average quartz crystal. Um... So I don't know what to say about that one. It looks like it's had a bit of different colours of different colours of paint on it. So I don't know with that one. But Stegosaurite, yeah, I've got another one of those. Let's see what else we've got. Now, this one I've been waiting for to see. This is the uh, Gargoyle Source. I don't know how to pronounce that. Gargoyle Light. Uh, this is a thing that looks similar to a Ankylosaurus, basically. I think it's part of the family of the Ankylosaurus, if I remember correctly. Apparently, the... Uh, this, this, oh, there we go. Oh, that's beautiful, people, right there. Um, I can't remember what this is. I think it's like, um, oh, not pyrite, but oh, I can't remember the name of this one. So if someone can leave a message in the chat what, what, what this uh, gemstone is. Okay, the name escapes me right now. But it's like a clump of metal with uh, crystals throughout through it because it's got like a crystal thing in, in, within the metal. So I don't know, I can't remember what the name of this one is. So if anyone leaves me a comment below, let me know what uh, that 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 uh, gemstone, uh, gem gem rock is. I can't remember what it's called. Um, 
It's definitely, I'm not sure if it's another quartz or geode. I don't, I'm not sure if it is or not, but anyway. Keep coming down the line. Elasmosaurus, which is basically like a plesiosaur. And uh, an interesting thing about the elasmosaur uh, was someone stuck the head on the wrong end. So, so you had this big long neck sticking out, and it turned out it wasn't a real long neck. It was actually the tail. So they had to go and stick the other end of the elasmosaur head back on the elasmosaur other end, which which became the tail became the head, and the, and the, and the head became the tail because it was at the wrong end when they were putting the fossil together. So that was interesting. Uh, let's see what we've got for this thing. I think it's another geode. There we go. Another beautiful, beautiful geode. And by the look of things, it looks like it's like part of the top skin of a dinosaur on the top, on the, on the other side. It looks like a part of the elasmosaur on the, on the back half with the uh, geode inside the bone structure. So that's, I, I like that one. That one actually looks like a proper piece so you know that's that, that one looks really really good and I really like that one that one was absolutely amazing I really really like that one the elasmosaur okay plesiosaur fine uh, to be coming down to the stretch now we have one two Three, four, five packets to go, people. Five packs to go. Uh, here we go again. Uh. So what's this one here? Okay, another Spinosaur. And, of course, uh, with the Spinosaur, right, it's another Geode, I believe. And, yes, there we go. <laughs> God, on this other end here, it looks like like a dinosaur. Sh it looks like a spinosaur shit, almost. On the other end, Ugh, that looks messy. Uh, well, then again, it could have been uh, when someone was making this, it broke and they put uh, like plaster sealant on it to try and seal it back up for if, if, if it broke. Um, but, yeah, that looks really, really messy. You can see all this sort of white stuff on it, and uh, that's a bit messy. It almost like a plastery, like a, like a plaster-type glue. They were trying to stick it back together if it cracked or something. But, uh, yeah, that's kind of nasty. Now, they were trying to paint over it so no one would actually recognise that they actually accidentally cracked it. Yeah, that wasn't a smart move, guys. Yeah, so, yeah, this, this thing actually got broken, I think, and someone stuck it back together. And that was at the manufacturing plant. That wasn't from the seller who I bought this from, because it was actually sealed before I opened it. So, I don't know what happened there, but yeah. But look at things, it was cracked and broken, and then they tried to seal it. Uh, dino, dino arts, that, that wasn't such a good idea. But anyway, that was a nice Spinosaur eye. I should start putting these ones back in the bag, actually. I know which ones I've done. Sorry, people, I'm just going to take a little bit long here just putting all these guys away. Okay. Now we're back into the unboxing. Oh, here we go. Oh. Ah, here we go. This is a packy. Pachycephalosaurus, and if I remember Pachycephalosaurus, uh, it was also a part of the Dracorex, 
um, family. And let's have a look at this. Oh, there we go. A lovely quartz crystal again. Um, again, it's a lovely, it's a lovely quartz. Um, but because I think someone's painted it a little bit, I can't really see what kind of actual quartz is, whether it's a rose or a clear standard quartz crystal. Because uh, they painted it yellow. But, uh, but it is a very nice looking quartz, a piece of quartz. Uh, a lovely, lovely piece of, a big rock of quartz crystal. Very, very beautiful, very, very nice. And there's the card for it as well. Very beautiful quartz crystal. So let's keep going. I think I've, I think I've only come to the one I was looking for, but not quite. Oh, hello, there's another Tyrannosaur one here. I wonder if this one's also another closer to what I'm after as well, or is this going to be another bone looking one? Well, this is interesting. Ah, uh, yeah, this is more of a, a bone one. This, this, is what, this is what a bone one looks like. Um, looks like it's part of the elbow joint or a knee joint. You see the big bulbous section up this end and the bottom part that's been snapped off. But there you go. So yeah, that's like a that's actually like a bone, like an arm or a leg bone, no, like a femur bone, I think. That's what they call it. Uh, you can see all the nice, nice grooving and ridging in there. I don't know if you guys can actually see that, but I'm hoping you can. There's a nice, nice ridge pattern in there for the, for this nice quartz crystal, um, fossilized quartz uh, dino bone. Looks very, very beautiful. It's a tyrannosaur, it has to be a tyrannosaur bone. Uh, fossilized crystal, crystallized into a quartz. But, uh, you know, very, very beautiful. But it's not the one I've been looking for. But it's still beautiful all the same. Ugh. And there's the uh, tyrannosaur card. But I think I have found one that come close to the one I want on the card. So I'll come back to that one at the end if I can't find another one of them that I'm after like that. So I think I've found a Tyrannosaur crystal one, but I was hoping to find another. But uh, I don't think we're I don't think we're going to be any, in any luck here. Ah, no, Parasaurolophus. All right, and if I remember correctly, that's another geode. Oh, there we go. Yes. Oh, that's beautiful. There we go. Another beautiful geode. Very, very lovely. Very, very beautiful. Um, I don't know if they're quite a, a spire geode. I don't know. Crystal spire geode. I don't know. Spiral, spiral. I don't know. But, yeah, that's quite beautiful and nice. But, uh, and there's the card for it. Um, uh, still not the one I'm looking for though, but I think I've got the one I'm after, as far as the T-Rex goes, I think I've found one, so that's all I need, uh, okay, coming to the final packet now people, and this one is Another Majungasaurus. Uh, another clump of metal. There we go. Another clump of melted metal. Mm. Yeah. Okay, people. Well, that's all there is. And I think this one here. This beautiful one right here. That's the closest I'm going to come close to actually a Tyrannosaur tooth looking one. Uh, I think that might be it, people. But that's very, very beautiful. And I think that's the closest I'm going to ever get to my Tyrannosaur tooth looking, uh, Tyrannosaur tooth comet looking one. Because that's the one that's on 
the cover here, uh, you see it on the cover, you see it also on the Tyrannosaur card, and you also see it here on the back uh, of, the, of the card. This is, this is the one I've been trying to look for for a while, and as far as I can tell, uh, this one is the one that really comes closest to what I was looking for. So, yeah, it's the closest, it's, there we go, ah, there we go, it's the closest it's, it's ever been, because all the other ones I've had of a Tyrannosaur uh, Geode Crystal has always been a, like a, like a knuckle bone or a joint bone kind of look to it. This is the only one that so far that's actually looked like a tooth, a ragged tooth, so I'm quite happy with that. I think that will be the one I've been looking for. So, not really, but it's the closest I can get to the one I've been searching for, for the collection. I mean, all these other ones are quite nice too, and they'll all go nice in my um, dinosaur fossil collection. Although these aren't really fossils, these are more mineral deposits than anything, like the geodes and the quartz crystal. It's more of a, um, like I said, more like, like a, like a uh, mineral, mineral deposit, more than actual like a fossil, but... Hey, like I said, again, if there's any fossil people out there or any fossil experts, let me know if, if, if there is some fossils that actually crystallise like that inside, um, some of the fossil bones. I'd love to hear about that. Um, shoot me up in the comments or shoot me up on my um, you know, Google Hangouts or Gmail and uh, we can have a chat about it. So thank you very much, people, for watching and I hope to catch us all later, people. Bye.